everybody, this is Reina. Today I would like to talk to you guys about something that I wanted to talk about for such a long time and then I'm missing opportunities. It is how much it sucks to be male. There is one video, not a video, news I saw a long, long time ago and then I started to think that some female misunderstand the whole concept of equality with men and female thing. Yeah, this news I want to talk about is this. This lady wanted to be a fighter fighter. And then there are two different types of fighter fighters here for the female and for the male. And this lady didn't want to have any special treatment, so he, she wanted to, you know, go join in this uh, fire department filled with, you know, manly men, I guess. And then she was requesting this opportunity to take a physical test to be firefighter, you know, not special female firefighter. The fire department told her that it's going to be too tough, so the request was denied, but this lady thought that it's a really big time discrimination so she brought this issues to the media and of course she's gonna she got what she wished for the fair treatment taking physical test you know what you know what happened after that she took it okay and as this fire department told her it was too tough and she failed and in the and then you know what happened though she actually told the news that it was unfair. The test was designed for male and it is discrimination. And then I was like, what the hell is she talking about? Because to me, okay, physically, male and female are different, right? You know, not every case, but you know, in average, male is stronger than female. Isn't that given? You know? And then I am a kind of traditional. I respect, you know, the male role and a female role thing. And, and of course, things are now, the boundary of the female male role thing is now blur and everything. But uh, I still do believe that there are some things that female are superior compared to male. And some things are, of course, should be dominated by men. Get me? And sometimes I feel like, you know, guys are stuck in this position that have to deal with this female crap okay i am a female okay <laughs> now for example like this things has been changed and a female is starting to you know going into career and then uh, working with men and everything that's that's awesome that's awesome nothing against it and it is all good you know but for example i once heard about this treatment female gets one or two days off from work every month because of this pms deal or period thing right and then there are some of the ladies i actually saw on tv or video saying that they deserve it and that's normal and then that's how it's supposed to be but to me no it's not an equality or anything like that that's a nice gesture that uh, you know they are getting from the company right it's not about being fair or in anything they are very understanding and very accepting and then try to be nice to you and then at the time of having a one or two days off, who's covering that lady's position? It could be female who have the same problem and having a day or two off every month. That's cool. But if, you know, male substituting in that spot, and then I start wondering, does guys get those one or two days off every month because of the mood swing? No, right? And then I start to think that, you know, girls can get away with a lot of things still. Even though we say it should be equal, this, equal, that, but uh, it's not necessarily equal. It's more like uh, guys are getting a short end of the sticks, no? Maybe I'm thinking about this that, you know, it sucks to be male because of my husband, maybe. Sometimes I feel sorry for him because, okay, he is the main income earner of the household, right? I don't work as much as he does and I don't carry in, bring in much of money you know and then he works from seven o'clock eight o'clock to whatever and then you know comes home and he helps me out with the dishes and he does clean and he does laundry and sometimes he does even cook because i'm sometimes very lazy or spending too much time with tony playing outside and get tired and when he comes back and i'm still napping with tony ooh, i'm failing as a wife but you know that's and whenever I see him doing those things, and I feel like I'm very lucky, okay, I'm very lucky, and then it sucks to be guys. <laughs> of course, there are some things that suck to be girls, and I'm going to talk about that some other time, but sometimes I feel like, you know, some ladies are going against the male, 
and then say, I am the same, I should get this, I should be this way, or you guys should treat me this way, that way kind of thing. But the thing is though, we are not competing each other. We are supposed to be helping each other to create something together. And also maternity leave thing too. You know, it's a company is really nice enough to give female a chance to raise their kids and stuff and having those one year off and so whatnot. And some people complaining that they can't go back to the position they are working and stuff. I totally understand that though, who wants to go back to work and if they can't get their old job back and that pisses her off and stuff, I totally get it. Because they build their career to that point to be something in a company but at the same time there are guys or people who feel fill that position for a year and if this person does the good job then to me is like this person should have a equal opportunity to keep this job as well and then company you know have the right to choose who's gonna keep it or not and the thing is though right now i have a kid i totally understand because there are chances that we have to stop working or skip working and stuff when kids is sick and everything right so it cannot be exactly the same as you know same once we have a kid you know so i really do think that sometimes that female go against male for saying that's not fair and then this is this and you shouldn't treat me like this and da 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 and I feel sorry you guys have to deal with the female crap like that. <laughs> so I really do think that uh, you know we we are supposed to be playing for the same team, not going against each other. So I just wanted to talk to you about some female that I just don't get the idea or some statement they are making out there because sometimes to me is really illogical or to me misunderstanding of equality and just that nice gesture but what do you think what do you think have you ever mistreated by a company or man and it felt like it is really unfair and if so please share with me and if you are a guy out there you know, have to deal with this kind of female crap and then that uh, ticks you off or whatever, just let me know, okay? Yeah, that would be a fun conversation, no? But I don't want to go into this feminism, this, this, that kind of thing. So let's go easy on the topic and just like uh, have fun with the topic, okay? Thanks for listening and talk to you soon. Bye!